OTR performance. QSE Logistics, we use it. Check engine light. Man, OTR too. Stay away from the dealer for the most simplest reasons. I'm talking about the most simplest reasons, like a check engine light. Trust me when I say this. OTR performance, get you an OTR tool. I'm telling you, it's the bang for your book. OTR tool is the bang for your book. Certain things you can do like clear codes, clear ghost codes, reset after treatment system. Come on now. Hey, and, and out of all things, trust me, this is the thing that keep people on the side of the road. Guys, you can force a regen with an OTR tool. Can you believe that? Most things that you have to go to the dealer for, listen, you can plug your OTR tool up and you can force you a regen. You get live data, history about your truck. You can even get the information about your vehicle, year, make, model, VIN number, all that kind of stuff. Guys, I'm telling you, I'm not saying this tool can do everything, but I'm telling you right now, it can do majority of the things that'll get you off the side of the road to the shop if you gotta go to the shop. Most cases, you don't never have to go to the shop. You can clear that code, you can fix it, you can replace that sensor yourself, all with OTR performance, OTR tool. Click the link in my description right now and get you your OCR tool. Let's go. YouTube, what it is, man. It's your boy Young. You already know I'm back with another video, man. Late start after late start, but man, we getting done. So with that being said, if you're new to the channel, all that shit you do is like, comment, and subscribe. Drop a comment down below and tell your boy what's up. If you're old to the channel, you already know what it is, man. We out here making it happen, getting it done. It is what it is, man. We'll get it done. Got my visitors, visitors badge on. Went to my son's school today for his uh, Christmas party. Uh, yeah, man. You know, just doing your fatherly duties, man. My number one job in the world is being a father, man. I, there's nothing in the world that I, I take more pride in. Uh, being a father, man, that's, that's number one priority to me. Something I look, I have a, I'm passionate about. I love, I enjoy doing. I'm deeply in love with just being a father, man. Showing up, um, even when time is not on my side. I think it's so important that we show up for these, for these children, man. You know. So, with that being said, no matter what it takes, I'ma show up. So, we're dropping a load right now. Be a late night tonight, man. But we go, we gonna grind it out. You know, we trying to. I think this last, the end of the fourth quarter, man. So we gonna grind it out and uh, try to make what we can make and see what we can get to by the end of the year. I tell you what, though, it ain't gonna be like last year, but we might be cutting close. Ah, I gotta get this thing to lock. There it is. It ain't gonna be like last year, but you know. It is what it is. We still here. We still grateful. This load right here been heavy, bro. I'm telling you, like, I don't like this stuff, but I ain't finna complain. I'm finna take it. You know, right lane it. Do what I gotta do. Finna drop it in. Door 57. And uh, they don't got no MD out here, but I just seen a dropper that just came in with an MD. Hopefully we drop it and I can take it. Cause I gotta go to Rome. And you know, we could be grinding through the night, man. And hopefully I get a vlog out of this uh, this day, and I can upload it upload it for y'all for Friday's vlog and uh, show y'all what's going on out here. But trust me, it's rough, it's tough, and I'm telling you, it ain't looking good.
love it when the plan come together, man. And guess what? I just made me a new homeboy. Look at down here. Down in the blue KW from Texas. Amigo, man. Tell you guys, man, you never know, man. Whenever you can help somebody out, bro, do, 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 do what you can to help a person out, man, because he really couldn't speak English like that. You know what I'm saying? And I can make out what he's trying to say. He was asking, do I have seal cutters to cut the seal off his off his trailer so he can open up the doors and back into a door? The shipper wouldn't help him. So they told him that they didn't have seal cutters to cut it. So he came to me and showed me his paperwork and he asked me, can I open the door? I'm like, dang, you need help opening the door? He really need help, you know, with some seal cutters. And luckily, man, I had seal cutters. So we got the door open and he had a load of, uh, raid man so we got them bugs and stuff around the house you know thank him and he come all the way from texas told me he bought that load from texas all the way to georgia with that raid you know the raid with the people that got roaches and things like that yeah he had a whole truck load of it so yeah good fella man good guy i don't know him from a can of paint but you know i feel like everybody good because we all god's child and like anytime I can help somebody out, you know, I'm all for it, man. It didn't cost me nothing, you know, to stop what I was doing and go in my side box and pull those seal cutters out and help them out. It ain't took me five minutes. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, guys, the plan was, went just like I thought. That guy came around here and dropped this trailer. I'm gonna pick this trailer up because I just dropped the load in the door and I'm going to Rome, man. It's gonna be a long, long, long night, man. Long, long, long night, but guess what? Christmas is around the corner. And uh, yeah, this next week's check. So you know what that means. Yeah, sir, we done made it out the gate. Some of the hardest working people I know in my life. Some hard working people, man. I tell you, if I was ever run a company, I know who I want to hire. I'm telling you. And guess what, guys? I done sent my loaded call. I know an uh, unloaded call over 15 minutes ago. And ain't nobody respond to me. Why? Hey, they closed the doors up. I couldn't do it with one hand, man. So I'm out here. I just dropped off at DHL. I don't know if it was hand soap or what it was, but I no longer have nothing to do with it. I'm telling you, they work hard, boy. I'm telling you. And they're going to get the job done. They're going to get it done. I'm late night grinding, dog. Late night freaking grinding. And man, I picked me up a load out of Calhoun, bought the load back to Fairburn. Cool. No problem. Heavy behind load, but I right lane it and I got it there. They want me to move some chassis around. But man, I come to the Infinity lot, man. And y'all remember a couple months ago, a couple weeks ago, whatever you want to say, how Infinity look. Man, I can't believe this, dog. It's back again. It's back a freaking again that these containers are stacked up like it was before. I'm in shock, man. I'm in shock. Let me grab me a pen because I don't like touching nobody else's pens and uh, go over here. And uh, see if I can see what I gotta do, man. And on top of that, they done moved the trailer that was here. They done got a new house. Ah, <sighs> let's go see, man. Yeah, man, they done got a new house, man. They had a trailer sitting right here. Nah, they got. I don't know if you a little shack right there. But anyway, guys, look at all this mess back there. Like, look at look at all that, man. Look at this. Back like we was, man. Ha! Ah, shoot. At least I know I ain't out here by myself. But man, we got new chassis over there. Man, look over here. Look at this jump, right, man? It feel like I'm out here with. It feel like an apocalypse out here, man. Right, look at this, man. 
Oh, boy, just when we thought it was getting better. Hey, that's what we thought. That's what we freaking thought, man. Golly. Mm, 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 mm. They done stacked back up, boys. They done stacked back up, man. A whole lot of new chassis, though. A whole heap of them, man. You know, let's hope for the best, man. But at this time, I'm telling you, man, this don't look too good. This don't look too freaking good, man. Holly. But what can we do? Just keep going. Taking it one day at a time, dog. I'm going to grab this chassis and I'm going to get up out of here. I don't know what. And I'm having a dog on light problem on the chassis, dog. So y'all know my y'all know what I told y'all. I got a whole bunch of seals, and I just cut me a little bit off, and I fold it, and I'm gonna show you what I did. So do for those of you that you know be having problems with your your lights on your trailer flickering because of uh because of uh the electrical prong is loose. So I'm get out and show you what I did. Hold on. So I cut me a little piece off. And see how, see, see right there? Right there on the right hand side, you see that seal down there at the side? So I basically fold me a little bit and stick it right in that little crease where the uh, loops at. And that way, this prong don't, uh, don't shake, don't move around, and the lights will work. You know, that's a little tree shade job right there. But hopefully you know what I'm talking about. Hopefully you know what I'm talking about, man. It's laid out here. It's cold out here. And these are the sacrifices that I be talking about, man. I would much rather be in my bed right now. You know. But I'm out here making it happen. made it off the truck man been a long day but through it all we got it done man and uh we will try to do it again uh i think tuesday tuesday because you know as you know christmas is monday and uh we gonna kick back and we gonna relax and we gonna spend time with the kiddos man and, and try to enjoy you know the blessings that continue to pour, pour upon us man no matter how tough it is no matter how rough it is uh, one thing for sure that i know i'm a blessed individual and uh every day i have an opportunity to get out here and uh try to make something out of myself and uh do god's work um so with that being said man just always look on the bright side of things man it could be worth much worse than what it is much worse 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 God, dog getting tongue twisted. It could be much worse than what it is. You know what I'm saying? Um, and guys, I'm telling you, I'm, I'm transparent. I mess up while I'm vlogging. You know, I stutter. Uh, no matter what it is, man, I'm, I'm that real in real life, man. Like, I'm transparent, so I don't believe in uh, cutting the video off, starting over, trying to say everything I said. I'm going to upload it just like I record it, man, because I'm transparent. This is my life. I'm not perfect. And, uh, I just want you to know that you don't have to be perfect. You know what I'm saying? Um, we all human. We all make mistakes. And uh, every day is a growing, growing process. Um, every day is a new lesson. So just know that. Um, transparent. Straightforward. I ain't cutting corners, man. It is what it is. Um, but yeah, guys. Uh, Merry Christmas to everybody. Um, I hope you able to get home if you OTR. Um, spend time with your family uh, on this day, on on Christmas or uh, on this weekend, or uh, however much time that you take off. Um, I hope that you really like pour into your loved ones because life is short, man. Life is really, really short, and uh, no man, no one man 
know the time, day, or the hour. Um, so with that being said, once again, if you're new to the channel, all that's that you do is like, comment, and subscribe. Drop a comment down below and tell your boy what's up. Because I'm going to say what's up back. And you know, I'll catch you on Tuesday, Wednesday, next week. I might do a little vlogging, a little lifestyle vlogging about Christmas and stuff like that. Um, I know this is a trucking channel and people like to watch trucking, but guys, like I want it, like I always say, I want my channel to be well rounded, man. Like you can know all parts of me, all sides of me. So um, with that being said, it is what it is, man. It's your boy Young and the police, I hear him coming. So I gotta go. Yo! Yeah!